Hey guys, welcome to another video, and in this video, I'll be showing you guys how you can get the new user's license and the licensed badge on the Roblox developer forms. First of all, what you want to do is um, create a Roblox account, obviously. So let me just create a Roblox account. Once you guys create a Roblox account, go to the over disk gear icon, click settings. And then what you want to do next is you want to add an email account and verify your email you want to send for verification and you go and verify your email address as you guys can see here my account is verified email is verified so if i go to account settings you guys can see that my email address is verified and note that you need to have one email account per dev form account so your developer form account can only be assigned to one email so let's say you have another account with the same email address and you want to log into your developer form account it will not work it will only work with the first account that you've logged into in the developer forms next what you want to do is go to devform.roblox.com press login once you've logged in you'll see your first notification so i'd like to begin read it later or skip these few steps now what you want to do is just click anywhere you want press your profile and click on disco bot and greetings next thing what you want to do is if you read this, you just do exactly what it tells you to. So you just press three dots, bookmark, just set it to tomorrow because why not? And then your basic tutorial will begin. What you want to do is you just want to copy this. You want to reply, enter, click done. What's this? Reply, smile face, message, done. So that's finished. Just mention Disco Bot. message done so basically just follow what they're telling you to do and you should be getting the badge in no time this is just a speed run and a summary on how you can get the basic tutorial badge highlight this press quote message done here you can just right click copy image part it apply control v paste the image it'll upload the image and then press message once that's done you'll like it and it'll tell you to go up here and report it so you click the three dots flag it's inappropriate by post and the moderator will review it if it was an actual post next thing go up here press the magnifying glass press the in this topic tap a barrel enter and then it will take you all the way up here again apply give this thing a herb message will take you straight back down now you've completed the basic tutorial for the developer forms and you'll see that you got the certified badge now next thing that you want to do to get the advanced tutorial and get the license badge is you want to press apply type start advanced tutorial just like this press message and it will start your advanced tutorial so Here's editing, they'll teach you how to edit. Press the three dots. Press the pen button, or the pencil button, and just re replace it with whatever you want. So I just place an I. Save edit, and it will continue on going further. Press the bin button, it's deleted. Wait for the scope out to reply, then undelete it, press the three things here, and press the first thing. Now I'll just reply with the same thing here. Just like that. Change the topic right here from watching to tracking. Once that's done, press apply, press the gear icon, press hide details, and type in whatever you want here, and then press message. Once that's done, you've earned your license badge and you've completed the advanced tutorial. So go to preferences, go to summary, and go to badges and you will see you have the certified badge and the license badge now from my knowledge is this is the same thing for almost every single discourse form page because as the developer form uses discourse and uh this should be the same process for almost every single discourse form page if it's the same if it's enabled like this right 
And um, yeah, that's basically the tutorial on how you can get the licensed and certified badge on the Roblox developer forums. And um, yeah, if you guys want to know how to get the developer forums group, like a flare on your badge, go to devforums.roblox.com slash G. Once you've done that, select what group that you specialize in. For me, I will type in translator, web developers, and programmers. Then you press the profile, go to summary again, press preferences, and then select your title and flare. Changes. And then refresh your page and you should have it right there so if you guys found this tutorial helpful please press the like button um if you have any issues please tell me in the comments below this shouldn't really be an issue and i shouldn't really make this video anyways but i thought i should just in case somebody wants these badges to show off to your friends like hey i completed the tutorial you don't know how to do it and whatnot and um yeah this is it for this tutorial video uh and I'll see you guys later. Peace. Mwah.